So today it has been requested that we <laughs> that we make a pumpkin pie, or at least a pie of some sort. We chose pumpkin, um, and we're supposed to do it with one of us blindfolded. It was recommended that the person with the most baking experience, me, to be the hands and guidance of the journey. So hence why Kyle's blindfolded. <laughs> Hopefully this will be not super messy. Don't. Let's give it. No promises at all. <laughs> no promises. Uh -uh. We'll see how this goes. The salt and uh, salt and flour first. Tap the bottom of the. There you go. Ding ding. Hi! Careful with your fingers. Really? Yeah! yeah. Is this just flour in here? Flour and salt. Oh, okay. Oh, yep, yep, yep. You're gonna use that okay. to scrape. Ah! Okay, there's nothing in it then. No! <laughs> As I said before you screamed! S ah! Scoop. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. How are you doing, hon? Yeah, I'm doing great. <laughs> I packed that in good, didn't I? You think? I'm gonna pack it in. Let it maybe get. Woo! chill that for 30 minutes okay. we're gonna chill yo and then we're gonna um, get the ingredients for the pumpkin pie <laughs> pumpkin pie filling ingredients together and we have to measure out a couple of things so we're gonna try and I'm gonna be his eyes and potentially his hands as well <laughs> but we'll see how this goes up yeah. cheers oh, dear. <laughs> you almost dropped it all right huh? uh, here comes Mix it up. <laughs> Hi. And that's blindsided. <laughs> so if you're making the pie, does that make you the pied piper? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be a thick crust. That's okay. I remember making a um, cheesecake for my mom one year for her birthday, and it was my first time trying to do so with graham crackers and unfortunately um, the crust was very thick in the bottom so it looked like a very triangular um, crust, uh, graham crust. So um, I learned from my mistakes afterwards, uh, just don't use graham, <laughs> don't use it up on the side, just use it at the bottom. Now that we're looking a little crusty, we're going to add some filling to make it look a little better. Yep. And taste better. With our oven at 400 degrees already made up, we're gonna bake this for 40 minutes or so, and we're gonna keep an eye on it just to see how it looks, and then we're gonna see how it tastes. Yep. Ready, set, go. Well, it is well past pie o'clock, so we are gonna have <laughs> our pie and eat it too. Mm -hmm. Thanks for joining us for Blindfold Pie. We hope to see you next time, and hopefully you can en you enjoy your own pie. Mm-mm-mm. <laughs>